President Salva Kiir on Monday pledges to reshape the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and International Cooperation in a bid to fulfill its mandate. President Kiir was speaking while presiding over swearing-in ceremony of the new appointed, newly appointed Deputy Minister of Foreign Affairs and International Cooperation, Ramadan Goj. The oath was administered by the Deputy Chief Justice John Gadwich Lul. The presidential advisor on national security affairs to Garlock Manime encourages officials in the foreign ministry to work together to deliver on to deliver the services. On his part, Foreign Minister Dr. James Bitter Morgan assured the president of Dear Redness to effect reforms in the ministry has to clean the ministry's image both within and outside. That uh, the foreign affairs, the open crisis to China, to China or foreign affairs, kind of corruption, kind of tomorrow, kind of you know, it starts with the foreign affairs. So be careful. Mal is a mocheta fogu, mal fogu machaka. Anyway, uh, the people who will be helping you to shape the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, I will be one of them. Lano Aljana Lokan, Loder Yimchi. I can adore the Ukraine, but to be a do. Paita, Ita, but after Sildim, we can turn the book. One of the talking, uh, Sulaman, Kaye Mars, uh, Madame of Basada, a Kamel Mabat, a Santaja Hamela, the Amel of Kai. Uh, it's a mother, you have the answer. My deep city shark and a telephone. I'm not a girl, can I be zero for a girl, can I be zero? ضمنه <تصفيق> Our first priority that we want to promise here to His Excellency is to make sure that the Minister of Foreign Affairs has to change. Has to change completely from where it was to something else. So that we start changing the image of the ministry inside and then also outside. I'm very happy for your appointment and count on me. I'll be working with you very closely. Uh, second, uh, next year will be one of the important years in the history of the Republic of South Sudan that the first election ever will be conducted after the independence. The uh, Ministry of Foreign Affairs will have a great role uh, to convince the international community to help South Sudan uh, for the election to be conducted because uh, by the end of the interim period, we need an elected government in uh, the Republic of South Sudan. And uh, we know that uh, many politicians, they don't like the election, they just want to stay in offices. But it's uh, our president only, I believe, that is our president only who won election to be conducted uh, in this country. And many of you actually will share the same idea with me. So we'll push in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs uh, that the ministry will be at the forefront actually to help uh, the president uh, for the election to be conducted uh, in the country.